Welcome to the homework for lesson 15. It's grade 2, module 4. Get your name on here first. And solve each problem using vertical form. Show the subtraction on the place value chart with chips. And exchange 110 for 10 ones when necessary. Fifty three minus thirty one, and we have enough ones, so three minus one that's two, five minus three that's two, and we still have the hundred left. We have hundred, five tens, one, two, three, four, five, and three ones, one, two, three, and we can cross out. One, and we can cross out three tens, and we have a hundred left, two tens left, and two ones. Now we have 153 minus 38. And you can see our subtrahend here. We don't have enough ones. Now we can't subtract up, we can't do 8 minus 3, because that would be subtracting our menu end instead of our subtrahend. So we've got to break up one of these tens, four tens left, ten more ones, so that's three and ten, thirteen ones we'll have. Now we look at 13 minus 8, that's five, four tens minus three tens, that's a ten left. And we still have the hundred. One hundred, two, three, four, five tens, three ones, one, two, three. That's our menu end. <clears throat> and now we're going to cross out thirty-eight, three tens, and eight ones. Thirty-eight. We don't have eight ones, so we have to unbundle it a ten. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now we can cross out eight ones. There. And three tens. Two, three. And we have one hundred left, one ten left, and we have five ones left, one hundred fifteen. One hundred sixty. Minus 37. We don't have any ones, so we have to unbundle one of these tens. That'll leave us five tens left. And that'll give us ten ones. Ten minus seven is three. Five minus five tens minus three tens, two tens left, and we still have the hundred. And our minuend is one hundred. One, two, three, four, five, six tens. We don't have any ones in our menu end. That's why we have to break up one of the tens. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now we can cross out seven ones and three tens. And we have a hundred. And two tens left and three ones. 123. 182. We're subtracting 59. That's our subtrahend. Five tens and nine ones. We don't have enough ones to take away nine ones, so we'll have to unbundle a ten. We'll have seven tens left after we break up that ten. But we'll have 10 more ones. So 10 ones plus the two we already have here. That's 12 ones. 12 minus 9 is 3. 7 minus 5 is 2. And we still have the 100. So our menu end was 182. So that's 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 81, 82. We need to cross out five tens and nine ones, but we don't have nine ones, so we have to break up one of these tens. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And you can see that's where now we have five, six, seven, tens, right? Just like here. And how many ones do we have? These ten and the two we started with, twelve, ten, eleven, twelve, just like up there. And now we can do our subtraction. Nine ones we cross out and five tens. One, two, three, four, five. We have a hundred left. We have two tens left and we have three ones left. 123. Now we have a little fractured math to investigate. Lisa solved 166 minus 48 vertically and on her place value chart. Explain what Lisa did correctly and what she needs to fix. Well, let's look at our her vertical method. She had 6, 166 minus 48, so she's got her 1s and her 10s matched up there. She didn't have enough 1s to subtract 8, so she had to unbundle a 10. Should have 5 left. She does. 10 more 1s is 16. Good. Then their subtraction, 16 minus 8 is 8. 5 minus 4 shouldn't be 0. That should be a 1. So there's a mistake that she made right there. And now if we look at her place value chart, let's see what she did. Uh, she unbundled a 10. Did she start with 166, right? She did 100. Six and six, okay. Unbundled this ten. There's all ten. And she had to cross out eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. She did. Um, but then she didn't subtract any tens. So she still needs to subtract four tens. So what did she do correctly? Uh, she unbundled a 10, which is something that she had to do. So she correctly unbundled a 10. And she correctly subtracted eight ones. What does she need to fix? She needs to fix her subtraction with the tens, right? She needs to fix her her subtraction of tens. Five tens, and that could probably be enough right there. But let's see. <clears throat> Five tens minus four tens should equal one ten left. The difference should be 
118.